Firstly, select the abdominal probe, then select the bladder setting. On the left of the screen, press measure and then select bladder. Three measurements will then appear. These are bladder length, bladder height and bladder width. To measure the bladder length, obtain a longitudinal view of the bladder with the probe marker towards the patient's head. Here we can see a longitudinal view of the bladder. A measurement has been taken along the length of the bladder, which gives a value of 9 cm. Next, obtain a transverse view of the bladder with the probe marker towards the patient's right. In this transverse view, the height of the bladder has been calculated. Finally, again in the transverse view, the width of the bladder has been calculated. As all three bladder measurements have now been taken, the machine can calculate the volume of the bladder. In this case, the machine has calculated it to be 340 mils. If preferred, you can obtain transverse and longitudinal views of the bladder and view them on the same screen by pressing the split button. The measurements can then be performed as shown previously. Most machines should have an option to calculate the bladder volume. However, if your machine does not, you can use the following formula. Simply obtain the three measurements as shown, then multiply these measurements against each other and multiply this number again by 0.72. This will provide a volume in mils. 0.72 is a correction coefficient that corrects for the shape of the bladder and can be used regardless of the shape.